you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable way to buy your FIFA 23 Ultimate Team coins, then please look no further than FIFAcoin.com. And to celebrate their 11-year anniversary, they've got a huge 10% discount up until the 10th of March. And you can get an extra 5% if you use my code Martin. Link will be in the description. Hi guys, Martin88 here and welcome back to another FIFA 23 video. And today we have got a 500,000 coin squad builder for you. Uh, yesterday's video was a 250k, so if that's more your budget and you're just starting out, go and have a little look for that. If you've got a higher budget, then stay tuned. We've got more squad builders on the way this week. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. We are going for a 4-2-3-1. Uh, to get it onto chemistry, it needs to be a 4-3-3. Um, brackets two variation and you will have to change a couple of the alternative positions okay if you wanted any um help with that just message me right okay so this is a league earned seria hybrid so I'm trying to keep it uh, a little bit different and let's get straight into the goalkeeper which is going to be donnarumma you always want to have a decent keeper like for the 250 we had courtois um you just get a nice solid keeper in there and then we can talk about the more exciting players. So Donnarumma is around 30,000 coins. So it just is what it is. Get him in the team. Right. So then at right back is our first Serie A player. And it is Jeremy Toulon. Who you don't see too much to be fair. But he's actually a really decent right back. You know Serie A is not a league that... Um, people go to too much for their players, but it's really good value. Very, very good value. So he's a winter wild card, uh, four star weak foot, six foot, so decent height, um, very, very good pace. So if we put, say, an anchor on this guy, we've got decent defending, good physicals, great pace, six foot, um, very, very solid right back indeed. And for 20, 20 odd thousand coins, what's not to like? All right, in at centre back, we've got a very, very solid centre back pair in here okay and they are both yeah they're both from Serie A to be fair right so the first one on the list is team of the year honourable mentions Bremer uh, from Juventus so put a shadow on him or maybe a catalyst if you wanted to because his passing is not great and his defending is maybe a catalyst but if you put put that on him his pace is then into the 90s, which is what we want. Um, his dribbling stats are okay, but then it's the defending and the physicals, which obviously make him um, a very good card indeed. Uh, Three-star weak foot, six foot two. He will do the job very nicely indeed. And in next to him is somebody that I rate very, very highly. And that is Future Stars Kalulu from AC Milan. Now, he is going for around 75,000 coins at the moment. And if we have a quick look at him, so obviously the uh, French nationality helps a lot here as well um, when trying to get him on uh, to chemistry. But six foot tall, exceptional pace. Once we've put a shadow onto him, his sprint speed is deep into the 90s, which was set back to right. Dribbling stats are amazing. Really very, very, very good. And he's got good defendings and good physicals. He, for me, is an absolute standout, an absolute monster. And for around 75,000 coins, I actually think that that's pretty fair, to be honest with you. So, yeah, nice centre-back pair in there. Right, in a left-back, we're back to um, Ligon. And it won't surprise you that we are going uh, for a PSG player. Now, I have to be honest, I do actually believe that this card is overpriced. But... I also believe that there is a massive shortage of decent fullbacks this year. And that's one of the reasons, coupled with the fact that he's easy to link, this guy, that he's the amount of coins he is. He's 50,000 50, coins. And for me, I think that's a little bit much for this. But anyway, he will do the job. And he is decent. I just think it's a little bit too much. But he's got the pace. So if we put an anchor on him, perfect. We've got top end pace. Uh, passing's good enough. Dribbling is okay, and then defending with physicals is decent as well. Just a solid, um, solid left back. Okay, into the, the midfield. So we are going back to the Serie A here, and the first one on the list is somebody that probably um, wouldn't jump to mind, and it's Jorginho Wijnaldum. A little bit of forgotten man in real life, but 
he got a World Cup card. And it's very, very, very good, to be fair. I like this card a lot. You see, every single stat is green. It's nice and solid. And for this budget of team as well, he can do a good job. If he had higher pace, I actually think that more people would be using him. Also, if he was Premier League, he'd definitely be more expensive. 40,000 coins. Um, a four-star weak foot, five foot nine. You can see that agility and the balance really helps him out. And he will give you a bit of everything. Plus, he can run all day long with that 97 stamina. So, for me, Wanyaldum, he's a tick. Definitely at this, this level in terms of budget. And next to him is a guy from Juventus. And it is Nicola Verguli. Um, this guy looks really very good, to be fair. So, let's have a look at him. So, he's, he's 40,000 coins, the same as one thousand, right? Uh, but he's got a lean body type, five-star weak foot, which is always nice. You have to sit up and pay attention when you see that. Um, if, as an example, it depends what you want to do. So, let's say Hunter or Shadow on him. That pace is going to be deep into the 90s. He's got that agility and the balance, both in the 90s as well. 96 short pass as well. This is a bit of a gem to me, um, this particular card. And again, 40,000 coins. I think that that's really very, very good. Right, okay. Let's go into the um, front four. So, we have got Diaz from AC Milan. Formerly of um, Manchester City. And he is 86 rated. A little, little gem, in my opinion. A little gem. So, he's... 16, 17,000 coins, something like that. Lean body type, five star uh, weak foot, four star skill moves, uh, lovely low center of gravity at five foot seven, the agility and balance through the roof. Again, what's there not to like? Okay, to finish off, let's move in to the front three and a very exciting front three, to be honest. So on the right, we have got Hervin Lozano. Really new card, actually. It's the... Um, Man of the match card that has just come out. And he is obviously a complete live wire. Uh, Lozano, you know exactly what you're going to get with him. Um, outright speed, loads of trickery will cause defenders a lot of problems. And on the left is very, very similar. A card that has been dropping quite a lot recently, but is still really quite good to be fair. 40-odd thousand coins for Gold Neymar. Five-star weak foot, five-star skill moves. Good speed, good agility. Um, and he's just one of them FIFA cards as well. So he is just going to be really good for you and do a very good job indeed. And then last but by no means least, to finish it off up front is Lotaro Martinez from Inter Milan. Uh, the 89 um, card. He's 50-odd thousand coins. So like really... Really frightening front three there. And a solid back line. I like this team a lot, to be fair. See there with Martinez. Um, get a hunter on him. Top-notch shoot in decent pace. Um, good dribbling stats as well. And again, at five foot nine, you can have that low center of gravity. So he will do a very good job for you. So guys, there we go. There's my 500k um, squad builder. Um, hope that helps some of you. If it has, please feel free to drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.